with fragile things. <laughs> hey, Beth, you need a hand with that fragile thing? <laughs> oh, no, 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 thank you. Uh, this is my final project for my ceramics class. I just need to leave it here for one minute while I pull the car around. Can you guys not break anything for one minute? Of course. No problem. I love you. Done. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Seriously, don't break this. I'll be back in literally one minute. <laughs> How could she have just left it there in front of us like that? I didn't even want to break it until she said not to break it. And now all I want to do is break it. <laughs> Look at it, just sitting there, taunting us, screaming, break me, break me. How dare you scream at me like that? Come on, come on. You want to break the ass? You want to break the ass? We just need to distract ourselves for one minute, and then she'll take it away. Well, there is one thing that always distracts us. We had a circus in your living room and only broke one thing, a little credit. <laughs> family meeting. We are going to discuss how things work around this house. Good, because we have a list of grievances. <laughs> Number one, I cut my foot on a broken vase in the living room. <laughs> you guys broke the vase. Number two, Beth plays the blame game too much. <laughs> Look, ever since you've moved in, you've either been destroying things or making a huge mess. Like, like burgers underwear lying everywhere. Uh, oh, Beth, I make a mountain out of a molehill. But it is a mountain. Years of practice finally paid off. Trip, I know you love being an iron weasel, but I don't think I can take this living arrangement anymore. Beth, we completely understand. Did you? Yes, of course. Good. So, where do you think you'll be living when you move out? <laughs> I'm talking about you guys moving out. <laughs> you have one more chance. If you mess up again, 
You're out of there. Yeah, Beth, you have our word. We will never do another thing to upset you ever again. Thank you. Starting now. <laughs> Oh, that's Carl, our laundry fairy. What? <laughs> He's not really a fairy, but we pretend he is and he does our laundry for free, so everybody wins. <laughs> and that? Okay, we have no idea what that is, but we should probably run. Tiki torches? Has your mum gone yet? Uh, not yet. Oh, here she comes. Get rid of those. Here. <sighs> what are you guys up to tonight? Oh, no big plans. Just another boring night at the house. Just that casual fake a yawn. Don't ruin it. <laughs> You're all dressed up, Mom. Aren't you just going to your ceramics class? Yeah, my ceramics teacher's a cutie, so I think it's time I start flirting with him. Flirting, huh? Are you any good at flirting? Me neither. Maybe we should practice on each other? Okay. Hi. <laughs> oh. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, I should be going. Behave yourself. Remember what my mom said. You only have one more chance. One more chance, Marty! Oh, yeah! Okay. Put this hand here. And this hand here. And your lips right here. Well, you are a natural. <laughs> Derek, your ex-girlfriend just showed up with some clown. Oh. Hello, Evelyn. Clown. Try not to get your hideous face paint all over the sofa. That goes for you too, clown. DJ Ash in the head. I think we're ready for something else. Yeah, like a weasel line. Yeah. Isn't that just a conga line? Oh, kid, a conga line is for a bunch of old people on a cruise ship. A weasel line's a rock band, a clown, and a bunch of cute girls. <laughs> oh, weasel line! Yourself, Wait! Wait, it's irresponsible to leave the house like this! There's ash everywhere, Derek. There was a fire. No, I meant there's ash everywhere. Ash's lame attempt at a solo album. <laughs> How 
how could this happen? Well, I thought to myself, I'm good enough to go solo. I have a great idea for an album cover. The house! Ash! <laughs> All right. Sorry, bro. I can't believe it's all ruined. It, when my mom sees this, she is going to freak. Well, maybe she won't. I mean, years from now, in the distant future, is anyone going to remember any of this? <laughs> hey, does anyone remember that time years ago in the distant past when we burned down the house? I certainly do. <laughs> Future's a dangerous place, bro. <laughs> when my mom sees this, she's gonna kick you guys out of here. No, she said we have one more chance. Nah, I think we used up that one more chance. I think she meant we have one more chance, then if we mess up again, then we're out. Yeah, that sounds right. It was this, then one more chance after that. Woo, that was close. That was oh. close. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Hey, Beth. How was ceramics class? My house. Mom. I, I know this looks bad, but it was an accident. I... Breaking my vase was an accident. Setting my house on fire is inexcusable. There's ash everywhere. Oh, it's... <laughs> I gave you one more chance, and you burned my house down. I want you out. Oh, so this is the one more chance. Oh, it's amazing. You know what you said? You said that. That. I I didn't believe it. Guys! Mom, please. I want them out. Now! Thank you for letting us stay here. So when you flirted with your ceramics teacher, did he flirt back? And Out! <laughs> the kids house and moving back into the band band isn't as bad as we thought yeah. put up a shelf and a few knickknacks and it's just like we're home again yeah. Yeah. well that's four hours down the drain yeah i thought living in the garage with my mom was bad it's really cramped in here oh this is not so bad kid you should see where the scopodopolises live <laughs> Mrs. Squapadopolis, Mrs. Squapadopolis, where's your coat? <laughs> You're still paying rent for three. Turn that music down! Uh, that's Mrs. Taguchi, the lady whose house we're parked in front of. She's always blaming us for things we didn't do. And stop your dog from eating out of my trash can! For the last time, we don't have a dog! Burger? <laughs> what? I don't eat out of that lady's trash cans. Wait, which house was that? <laughs> yeah, no! Well, you know, I, I, I guess this isn't so bad. I mean, you guys are nearby and we can still see each other. Well, actually, kid, you know, now that we're not tied down to one place anymore, <sighs> we were thinking that maybe we should start traveling the country again, playing gigs. Yeah. Well, I can't go on the road. I have school and I'm living with my mom. What about our record deal? Maybe Berger, Ash, and I could just do a small tour and then we could record our parts from wherever we are. 
Yeah. And meanwhile, you'll be touring without me? No, I'm not letting this tear Iron Weasel apart. I'm gonna talk to my mom and get her to let you guys move back in. You guys are my family now. We are like family. I'm like his dad. <laughs> I'm like his big brother. And I'm like Mrs. Taguchi. You're nothing like me! Stop yelling at me! <laughs> in their van, they haven't showered, and Burger is eating out of the neighbor's trash. So, besides the van, nothing's changed. <laughs> Mom, please, it's... Trip, my decision is final. I am never going to forgive those guys. Now go put this box in the garage. Mrs. Campbell? Yes. My team has determined the cause of the fire. Was this curling iron? Bum, bum, bum! <laughs> Sorry, it's a routine house fire. I thought I'd jazz it up with some sound effects. That's my curling iron. <laughs> oh, no. I blame the guys for this fire when it was my fault all along. Tell me I'm not an awful, horrible person. Well, this has become awkward. I'm gonna go now. I've done a lot of thinking over the past minute, and I'm finally prepared to forgive those guys. What happened in the past minute? Nothing. Why do you think something would have happened in the past minute? Let's go touch the guys. Perfect. The flat screen looks great there. Good news, Beth. The TV from your bedroom didn't burn in the fire. Guys, we need to talk. Yes, yes, we do. <clears throat> uh, since ancient times, when Prometheus first brought fire down from the Olympian gods, mankind has always been drawn to the flame. I know the fire was an accident. Oh, pooh, I had a whole thing prepared. <laughs> Everyone's human, right? I say forgive and forget. Accidents happen. No, Beth. We accept responsibility. Only a complete idiot could start a fire and burn a house down. Yeah. Well, you don't have to be a complete idiot. Lots of fires are caused by people with above-average intelligence. People like me? No, Beth, we're not like you. We envy you. You get to look at yourself in the mirror every night and say, I didn't burn anything down today. <laughs> Okay, look, I'm the one who... Stop that yelling! We're not yelling, Mrs. Taguchi. We're making pleasant conversation. Except now I'm yelling because you forced me to. I really hate that lady. <laughs> Only an awful, horrible person would blame someone for something they didn't even do. Horrible. Bad, bad, bad Anyway, Beth, what was that you were saying a moment early? It was something about I was the one who... <laughs> I was going to say, I'm the one who is ready to forgive you guys for causing the fire. You can move back in. Hey! 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 We can stay together. Moving back, back in party! party! I'll bring the tiki torches. <laughs> Too soon. <laughs> Don't worry, kids. Your stuff may be gone, but you still got your memories. Birthdays, holidays, made up holidays. Happy single day mustache! <laughs> She's in the garage. Can I help you? I just came by to give her the final report on the cause of the fire. Do, do, do. <laughs> Your mom's curling iron. <gasps> she started the fire? She seemed pretty upset about it last night when she found out. She knew? Whoa. <laughs> 
Looks like you've just learned some important new information. Boom, boom! Have a good evening, guys, really. Yeah, that's good. I can't believe my mom caused the fire. And she let us think we did it. And she came to the van and lied to us, smelling all pretty and looking like an angel. <laughs> We need to teach my mom a lesson. Don't worry. She'll get hers in the future. What? Nothing. <laughs> Ding! Thanks for letting the guys move back in, Mom. If the band broke up, I don't know what I'd do. Beth, we feel terrible about what we did to your house. Oh, Derek, please, bygones. No, no, we're a bad influence. Your son will be much better off without us. We're giving up the rocker lifestyle and we're moving away. I'm going back to being a magician. Oh. <laughs> what? You can't do this to me. What about Iron Weasel? This milk is Iron Weasel. <laughs> This can't be happening. Are you bailing on Iron Weasel 2 Burger? Yes. I have decided to pursue a career as a karate master. Imagine these boards are Iron Weasel. Once they were whole. But now. <laughs> Okay, uh, imagine the bones in my hand are iron weasel. <laughs> Shattered and broken. <laughs> what about you, Ash? You leaving too? Yep. Got my new career all picked out. This one didn't work. <laughs> Mom, don't let him go. Ignore him, Beth. He's just a boy. He doesn't understand that adults can't all live their lives like... The Joker. That's the two of clubs. Oh, yes. But if I rip it into pieces and blow, it transforms back into... The Joker. Still a two of clubs. Right. But if you check your back pocket, I think you'll find ta-da. Still the two of clubs. Okay, really. <laughs> Kid, you're like the son I always wanted. Except your name isn't Desmond and you don't look like this. Sleeping? Yes. Don't care. Could you reach inside your pillowcase? In there you'll find an envelope. Please open it and inside I think you'll find the chip. Still the two of clubs. <laughs> Darn it, I guess I'll never win. Night, Beth. Night. 
Is this your car? Saturday. Get ready for the galaxy's greatest hits. We're listening. Guardians of the Galaxy premieres Saturday at 9.30 on Disney XD.